Hey, what's up everyone? Danny Lightning. So here it is. All right, here's the hanger you guys wanted, sort of. Like I said, I was going to take everybody's everybody's votes into consideration. And these are the robots the most people asked for. Like I added up every vote for Ravana. I added up every vote for Al June, every vote for Hades, every vote for Nemesis, every vote for Blitz. And these ones had the most votes on the... Uh, the little community tab the other day when I asked what hit what robots you wanted me to see some people voted for robots I didn't even have I gave you guys a list of everything I have and like I said my weapons are I don't really have enough weapons to go around to really just put the weapons you want on there so I had to choose the weapons myself I know one person was asking for rev trans on the Ravana someone wanted sparks on the blitz but I don't have anything else to put up on top of the Ares that's good. So I got Sparks and the uh, Cryos on the Blitz. So anyways, we're going to go ahead and play with this hanger. But yeah, this is kind of like the subscriber hanger for the week, I guess. So let's go do some battles. We'll play some Beacon Rush, I guess. So to battle we go. I just put on some boosters. I need to save up some silver because... I am broke. Unfortunately, we got the 25% off weekend, 25% off all the silver grade upgrades, and I have no silver, so I am broke. Let's start off with our blitz. We are going to blitz it up on this one. All right, here we go. And I forgot to change that one setting on my emulator, so we're probably going to have a crash here. I don't send, change that setting, I usually crash, which kind of stinks, but, uh, yep, these emula emulators are a little buggy. Here we go. Those guys are just a little too far away. He's about to go into last stand. This is actually a pretty cool setup here, to tell you the truth. Way better than most people would expect. I'm getting burned up by that thing. I don't want burned up yet. No, stop it. Aha. And he's he's out of here. I'm gonna go ahead and use this ability. Alright, let's go ahead and get this thing. So oh, we got a Nucleon Quarker robot up there. That guy is taking our stuff back here, so I'm going after this guy. I'm going after this guy. You cannot have my beacon, and that looks like some sort of dash robot. Alright, come on, get that lock on, buddy. And I think he's he's not in his ability right now, so he should be pretty easy to kill. Alright, there we go. Now I know he's probably going to spawn in. I should have probably come back here and grabbed... Yep, there he is. And he's got me. Well, that stinks. Alright, come back to home base. We're going to bring in the Ares. I figured he'd be up in the air. All right, he's gonna retreat, so I'm gonna come over this way. Let's go ahead and do this. All right, let's get this guy. See ya. Wouldn't wanna be ya. That dude was a little too far away, so we got our beacon back. I'm not really sure what I'm shooting there, but here comes someone. Three, two, Oh yeah, come on, keep shooting it. Keep shooting it. There we are. Double See you later. Ares is sweet. You know, I really wish I had some lockdowns for this guy. I might actually build... I'm probably going to keep building shredders for this dude. I don't know. Shredders would be nice. Triple kill. 
thing is, most of the time, people can easily get away from your Ares, alright? That's the one thing. If they're way out in the open, Ares is awesome. Or if you can lock them down. Well, that's the main thing I noticed, is it's pretty easy to get away from Ares most of the time. If you don't have lockdown. So I did put lockdown ammo on this guy. But yeah, two shredders or something, that would be perfect. Alright, I just used lockdown ammo on that guy. Oh, he went into his ability. Well, that stinks. Can't shoot anybody. And he's going to kill me. Alright, I'm, I'm dead. Alright, I'm dead. I can guarantee you that. That's the thing about Ares is... He's super, super squishy. So, one wrong mistake and you are done. Here's the Travena. Which, this is actually a really nice build. I'm probably going to play this build on Monday as well. I know some people think this is not a good build, but it actually really is. Alright, it seems like they've taken our beacon again. I'm gonna run in here. Blast this guy a few times. Alright, can't let him have it. I'm locked down. We got all kinds of junk going on over here, so I gotta run. Yeah, I gotta I gotta get out of here. Surprise attack on this guy. Alright, that didn't work out, did it? At least I got our beacon back. Now as far as the weapons, nobody asked for the Avengers. I just decided to throw the Avengers on here. I haven't played Avenger out June in a really long time, and it's actually pretty good. I know a lot of people don't think the Avengers are great since the nerf, but to tell you the truth, they are not bad. Come on, land, stop shoot, land. That guy was in the air forever. Goodness. All right, that sucked. I guess we lost that one? What's going on there? It wouldn't let me spawn in. Alright, I guess I'll spawn in on A then. I actually wanted to choose my Hades, but I brought in the Arthur by mistake, so... Let's just go ahead and get close to this guy. Alright, let's take him out. We gotta get rid of this thing, whatever it is. I think it's a Ravenna. It sure is. Oh wow, there's a Butch. You don't see that every day. Butch Cassidy in the house, guys. Butch Cassidy in the house. Just hurry up and die already, would you? You're getting on my nerves over there. Jeez. Oh, they're, they're all spawning in up here. I think he can bypass my shield from that angle. That's not good. Alright, that's not good. Hopefully my weapons are stronger than his because, yeah, he's, he's able to bypass my shield from up there. Oh, my shield's not even... Uh, well, there you have it. I guess it didn't matter anyways, but my shield wasn't even working, guys. Alrighty then. So, six kills, 1.7 million damage. Not bad. Not bad at all. Third place. The first two guys rocked it out, man. Look at that. Now, I'll tell you what. I really do miss having the, the premium VIP deal. It's, it's it felt like it feels like the gold or the silver comes in so much slower without that it was nice having that for a little while so I hope it comes back in those the daily deals for a couple bucks because we really like to have that again I think it's what fifteen dollars for a month worth worth which is actually not too bad but on my budget at the moment, 
It all adds up, you know. It all adds up. Next time it's like 299 or something, I'll get it again. It sucks having to be cheap, but sometimes you just gotta do it, you know. And it's like a whole team out here. Alright, there's no way I'm gonna get it, I guess. Some, I don't think. I'm just gonna do what I can do, and they blew me up, so. I definitely distracted them for a while. There was pretty much, the whole team was in there trying to take it, so. That may have helped my team get some extra beacons, I'm not really sure, but sometimes it's good to distract the enemies even if you sacrifice yourself. Like if you can distract the majority of the team, that can be actually a giant help to your teammates. The Avengers are still really good guys. Only problem with these things is they have a 10 second reload time, I don't like that. But they're really not that bad. Especially if you can get close to your enemies. Where did that come from? He has a last stand. See you later. Hello, Mr. Waylands. Oh, I have died. I seem to have died, and I think I picked the incorrect robot. Oh, crap. Yep, I picked the wrong robot. I picked the wrong... Oh, he's got shield popper, too. Son of a... You know what? Ah. get I love my Hades all I need is one more shredder I'm really thinking about just buying that with the gold how do they keep showing up behind me I don't get it everywhere I go someone pops up and spawns behind me on this match it's ridiculous I must be in their spawn point. I don't know what's going on, guys. I don't know what's going on. But I do know I'm going to get me a behemoth. Yes, sirree. Yes, sirree. Now hurry up and grab this beacon. Ooh, we're lagging something crazy. Don't shoot that thing. Stop pushing me. At least heal me if you're going to push me, guy. What's he doing? He turned around. He should have killed that thing. Sometimes you gotta wonder. I guess someone else started shooting. I don't know what happened there. That was weird. Anybody who says Hades is not a good robot doesn't know what they're talking about. I will tell you that right now. Unfortunately, that one escaped right before the death shot got him. Here he comes. Come on out. Come on out. That's right. Unless you got shield popper, you are one dead turd. Fortunately, my main weapon ran out of ammo and he's got some very strong healing. But 
We got that turd. <laughs> of course, if that's one of you guys, you're not a turd, okay? You're only a turd because you're the enemy. Don't take me too seriously. Alright? But you're still a turd. Sorta. Maybe. Kinda. Alright. There we go. I knew that was gonna happen. Let me pause this. I need to change those settings. You know what? I'm not even gonna pause this. I'm just gonna go ahead and change... You know what? I am gonna pause it because I need to report this. Alright, so I'm gonna go into settings developer options and change it so there is no background processes allowed all right so let's go ahead and open the game back up close that out war robots there we go now it probably won't crash again i don't know the emulators are buggy most android games are not designed to run on em emulators to tell you the truth so I don't know. I don't know. So let's start this guy back up. That was that was a fun battle too. I, I hate when it ends, especially when you're having a fun battle and it crashes out on you. That's always some bull tucky, whatever that means, but that's what it is, I guess. All right. Let's go play another battle. I'm telling you, gold adds up pretty darn fast if you play a lot and you do the test servers and you fill out the form and link your YouTube video. You know, I got links to all that stuff in the uh, description of my videos. So check those out if you haven't before. Let's see. I think we're going to start off with our blitz. Blitz time. Yeah, I think I am going to build two more shredders. I need at least, I don't know, I need a couple more light weapons. I did end up breaking down and buying that last operation, so I do have four gusts. Alright, the four ardent gusts, and I have the ardent blitz. One of these days, I'm going to level those things up, but... I'm not really sure what I would do with them at the moment. Alright, so we're just suppressing stuff to help our teammates. I can freeze and suppress right now, which is a big help. All right, there's a whole crap load of them. Man. How am I being healed? I don't understand what's healing me because I don't have the mechanic skill. That must be another blitz or something because he's not really taking any damage. That's crazy. And I got a... How'd that thing get back here? Get out of here. Get out of here. This is my home, not yours. Let's suppress this dude. Alright, he's in the last stand. Target who I tell you to target. Targeting system. Okay, we got a, we got a healing robot back here, so... That's not great. I think he's in his ability anymore. Suppressed. I would actually like to have... I don't know. I'm either going to build two more Shredders or two more Scourges. Scourges? What I mean to say is not Scourges. I mean to say is sparks. What is that? And why won't it take any damage? That must be Arthur. Holy crap, it's hurting me. That must be Arthur. What is that? And I'm in a bad spot. Help. Alright, this is No! No! This stinks. Somebody help me, please. I can't even move in any direction. This is terrible. All right, Ares. If you get caught in the wrong situation, he's a dead duck. 
That's why I don't play Ares that much anymore. He's great and he's terrible at the same time. He can pack a heck of a punch, but man, he just dies if you look at him funny. Now I know that's ready to go back up in the air. I thought that was now June. It's not. All right, he's down to his last stand. Oh, he decided to come down and play. Sometimes I guess you just figure, hey, I'm about to die anyways. Whoa, stupid Arthur. Big fat Arthur, don't you do that ever again. I, oh, crap. That hurt. But this is going to hurt even more. All right, remember, stay back. Stay back. Don't get within 100 meters of that thing. One thing about this setup, this is an Arthur killing setup right here because kinetic weapons do, what, 150% more damage to physical shields? So Flamethrower Aljun or Avenger Aljun should be great for taking down Arthurs. That wasn't that great. That was not a good battle for me. I had low damage and only two kills. Came in third place, though, so I guess that wasn't too bad. And it looks like we had another game freeze, which really stinks. This game does freeze a lot, okay? It doesn't ever, ever, ever do this on my phone. It's only on the emulator. It only freezes on the emulator. All right, so the game is being kind of lousy on the emulator today. I would really like to download this LD player emulator, but I keep reading about how there's like spyware or something built into that. There's a whole big thing about it, so I'm a little scared of it. I know that's probably one of the best emulators out there, but it just sounds a little scary right now. I know that's what Adrian and a couple of the other guys use. I know they're having some crashing issues as well, but uh, I'm not sure if they're as bad as mine. But this never used to crash until the last update came out. I'm not really sure what happened, but on one of the latest updates, things got a little crazy. Alright, now I got the long reload time to deal. What was that? I thought he jumped. It looked like he jumped, but I guess he just went up in the air to fly. I was like, man, that was a big jump. What even just hit me there? Oh, we got that guy. Well, sir, I'll be pleased to tell you I'll be your destruction today. Hope you enjoy your death by fire, because by fire and machine gun. And I seem to be out of fire, and he has a last stand, and here comes his buddy. Okay, never mind. I hope you enjoy killing me, sir, because... Looks like what's about to happen. I've got suppression on me, and I have died. So that did not work out as I had planned. Let's bring in the Ravena, guys. Let's bring in the Ravena. We're going to come down here, and uh, we are going to hit somebody in the eye. All right? It's an energy weapon. We are going to shoot a big plasma blast into somebody's eyeball. Ooh, yeah. Hope you like that, fool. Hope you like that, fool. Hope you like that. And I think he's in blitz mode because he's not taking much damage. Unblitz yourself, sir. Okay, there we are. Let me get in here, man. Let me get in here. I need some of that. I need some of that resources, okay? Let me get in on that action. I gotta find someone who's just a little bit closer. That thing is hitting- oh, that's a- that's a stinking Ming. Alright, I need to get back to cover. That's gonna kill me. That thing's got nasty weapons. 
and it's still hitting me. How is it hitting me? Alright, I'm dead. Those shotguns are terrible. Shotguns are still terrible. I really should mark two mine. At least to like level four or level five or something like that. Alright, help me fell off the edge to s oh crap. <clears throat> Let's see. Too bad the uh, enemies can't see my angry face. They would know it meant war, right? If they saw that, they would probably be scared, don't you think? Or would they just laugh? I'm not really sure. One or the other. They'd probably just laugh. Probably like you guys did. I bet you guys laughed. Alright, come on. Lock on to something. There we go. That guy's within range. Now lock him down. They're shooting my shield. Die. Squishy man. Oh no. No. Here it comes. Oh no. Help me, Arthur. Help me. Come on, Arthur. I need you now. I got seven seconds. I'm not going to make it. I'm not going to make it. Uh, help. Oh, man. Wait, I forgot to do the angry, angry face again. That's okay. I did the sad face instead. Close enough, right? Alright, so let's go ahead and run on in here. Ooh, they're hitting that one pretty hard. Is he in range? Suppressed and destroyed. No! Stupid targeting piece of crap, all a crap sandwich, curd breath, butt munch targeting system. You suck. How is that guy not frozen though? How is he not frozen? Sometimes I notice these freeze weapons don't freeze people when they should. There we go. Now he's frozen. I gotta remember, he goes right through the damage resistance. Come on, get it. Get it. I'm pretty much letting myself die to try and take out the Titan, and we still died. So, I'm gonna bring in my Arthur. I'm gonna get my revenge. It looks like he's still frozen, or at least he was for a second. Alright, see you later. Later, butt munch. All right, all right. Let's go this way. Cause somebody's probably gonna go ahead and try and take our thing over here. Ow! He's too far away too. There we go. Now you're in range. Feel the wrath of my machine gun, sucker. And I'm out of ammo, but here comes his buddy. They got our beacon, but here comes his buddy to uh, probably die. Uh-oh, this is not good. I gotta try and stay crap. He, he can bypass my shield. I hit him with that thing, but unfortunately he didn't fly back. He's got really strong weapons. That's it for me. The plasma mings are ridiculous, guys. Unfortunately, those weapons cost a fortune. And I think I'm just going to go ahead and leave this one. I'm not going to wait around to see how that plays out. Where are we at? 29 minutes. I'll play one more battle. One more battle, okay? One more battle. See if I can collect anything yet. But yeah, Monday I'm going to open those boxes. We're going to do an unboxing again on Monday.
after this, then I gotta make a video for something else. That'll just be a quick five minute video, I think, today on the other one. Alright, let's start off with our blitz. I hate being locked down. You know, someone keeps telling, people always say, hey, you should get an anti-control. And you know what? I totally would, except for you don't see as much lockdown these days. Like, if more people still ran the lockdown, I would definitely get an anti-control. That would actually be really, really nice. I know he's about to teleport, so he's going to be right back. Oh, I guess not. Maybe he died. He didn't teleport. They might have got him before he could leave. Oh, no, he just didn't do it. He might have ran out of time or something, but... No, I fell over. Hmm. All right, um, let's bring in the Yao Jun. There we go. He just went into leech mode, so I'm going to... I don't really want to attack him. Can't seem to hit that guy. Everybody's got something protecting them. That guy must be behind the building. At least I'll take down his shield, right? So maybe a teammate can hit him. I don't know. Nobody's doing nothing over there. Alright, we got a Wayland, which is nice, but you can't just like sit there like that, Mr. Wayland. If you want to heal people, you gotta move to your teammates. Alright, that Wayland. I guess he's more interested in killing people than healing, so. Can't really do much at the moment. Oh, he's leeched onto me. Don't shoot it. Look, look, someone's gonna shoot that thing and they're probably gonna kill me, right? That's what always seems to happen. Yep. Someone just hit it really hard, and I took a large chunk of damage right there. Right, I'm coming in for the kill. Maybe not. That thing's really tough, whatever it is. I'm going to get back to cover for a minute. Alright, cool. It died. We got the beacon. Everything over there is dead now. Alright. We've killed it all. I'm being shot by another Al June. Alright. Up we go, I see you, and you are a dead man. That's right, that's what you get for trying to kill me. That's what you get. Today it feels like my flight time is very short on the Aljun. It doesn't feel like I'm flying as long as normal. But I probably am, I probably am. That's a whole enemy team there. Oh, I can't believe I didn't get that kill. There we go. Mr. Falcon, I'm gonna get you. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. Uh oh. Wait. There's my angry face. If you're watching my video, you see my angry face. I'm talking to the guy. Crap, man. This is a bad day for crashes. Man, it doesn't usually crash this much. 
Alright, so I don't usually have this many crashes. I don't know what the deal is today. It just keeps crashing and freezing. Maybe I need to restart my computer or something. I have no idea. But anyways, alright, I think I'm going to go ahead and call this one quits. Hopefully you guys have a great day. And hopefully you guys enjo enjoyed watching me play this hangar. This is the one you guys asked for, sort of. So I don't know if this was the best way to do it. What I might start doing is maybe occasionally just, you know, giving you guys the list of the stuff I have and saying, hey, pick a hanger and then I'll pick one person's thing off the list, maybe. I'm not sure. That would probably be easier than trying to add up everything everybody did. Because that was actually kind of a pain. But yeah, I think I had like... There was a couple, there was Nemesis was really close, and Spectre was really close. Both of those had five votes, and Ares had six votes. That's why Ares got in. Ravana, Aljun, and Blitz both had like 10, 14 votes, I think. About 14 votes on each of those. Ares had, I don't know, Hades had... I think eight or nine votes. And then, yeah. Anyways, you get the idea. But I looked at the page. I wrote each robot down on a piece of paper. And every time I saw somebody ask for a robot, I put a check mark on the paper. And that's how I figured out the hanger. Oh, it looks like I get to collect something now. Let's go ahead and grab that. All right, 20 gold. Cool, cool. 73. I might actually just go ahead and buy that last shredder with gold, I'm thinking. Before I end this video, let's go see what that costs. I think it's 5,000. Right? 5,000 gold. It's going to cost me 4,000 because I've already got part of it produced. Do I want to buy that? See what it costs to buy some of these. Whoa. Why does that cost so much? I thought Scourges... I thought Sparks were 5,000 gold. That's nuts. 6,000... They must be like 7,500 now or something. That's terrible. You know, there's one problem I have with this game is it... Everything gets more and more and more and more expensive. Like most of the new weapons, you can't even afford... Like your average person can, can't even afford to get these past level 8 or level 9. It's like my cryos. They're at level 9. And the next, next upgrade is so expensive, I'm just like, you know what? I'm just going to leave them at level 9. I can't afford to upgrade these. Even the Scourges are getting really expensive now. And it looks like those are about to go up another one. Look, if I want to make this level 12, that's a 41 million. That's with the 25% off. Crazy. It's just getting too expensive. Even, I mean, it's, it's terrible. Getting terrible. That's an expensive one. Looks like I have that one. I don't know where I got that from. I got that one. I don't really like this one. The, a guy on Reddit made this. Cool guy, but I don't like his design. It's just, it's too bright for me. I don't know, it's... It's too bright. I like darker designs. <laughs> Kinda cool, but... Weird. <laughs> If it didn't have that orange, I think I might like it a little better. My favorite, though, my favorite's still this. It's like a rusty old robot. So anyways, now I'm just babbling on about nothing, but, uh... Yep, I will catch you guys later, alright? See ya.